Well, Biden, remember, like a couple of weeks ago, he put in a call from the Federal Reserve gas. Well, now I see that on Fox News or whatever. They're buying back on them to refill them. So now the smell gas is going to go through the roof because they're buying all the gas. Then we're shipping tons of fucking Well, that's why apparently they, they when they, you couldn't find ammo in stores just because all the production was going towards government stuff. And, uh, but I know they changed the laws on a lot of that powder because uh, one of my customers, a friend of mine, they do the can of shoots and they have to have a license to buy powder in like 50 pound kids. And they couldn't put the pounds in there. But they, they were smart, like a bunch of 80 year old guys. They, they buy a powder that nobody's business. They do the dry can of shoots for, for like, um, still on. Civil War, we had that shit. Sure. They shoot, Well, they lost all the people like North Dakota, a lot of the private land, and like the Indian land out there. But they shut them things down because you know, they're still going, but they're not going full strength. And, uh, but, you know, the, all the people left, and you know, all their. Yeah, so. so now they're struggling to get working for them. For Antwerp, just four years ago, there's 1,800 employees, now there's fucking 1,400. And that's, that's everybody. She can fucking work 80 hours a week if she wanted. Um, and that's, you know, everything after 40 is overtime. And they don't care. You know. And anything after, I think it's 2 o'clock in the afternoon, she gets paid. No, she isn't. Yeah, she does. No, she isn't. She's going to get you to the bridge. No, she isn't. She's good. Yeah, she can work Thank <laughs> you. 
Uh, 